Uh, you should get the table set. He'll be here any minute. Sit down. Oh. oh. It's your ex. Is she a spy? No. No, I'm not a spy. I promise. Spies don't usually have such beautiful hair, in my experience. Check her hair. That's how they got my suit. They put a bug in her hair sometimes. There are no spies, Helen, and no one took Sue. She comes here every week. Eat your breakfast. You have 15 more minutes. That's it. That's how they got her. That thing. Here. Here's this one. I checked it personally. It's safe. I promise. It was really lovely meeting you. I'll see you soon. Morning, ladies. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> lovely. And you're sure you haven't seen my Sue? No, Helen, I have not seen Sue, but I do know she's coming Friday and she comes every week. Liar! I got you. You're one of them, aren't you? No, I... Well, why would you say that my Sue was coming? The spies took her when she was 25 years old, and I haven't seen her since. If you've seen her, you must have took her. I am not a spy. Sue is coming. Sue... Helen, I do not know where Sue is. But I promise you, we will keep looking until we find her. Well, I thank you for that. I'll never stop looking for my Sue. She's my whole heart. I know. Maybe she'll come by for some peppermint tea. <laughs> Three weeks? The weather was perfect. June 4th, not too hot. And Hank wore this dark blue... Right in the middle of the yard! <laughs> here you go. Hank, get in here, please. Sit. That woman knows where Sue is, and she won't give us the information. Hey, it's okay. <laughs> Did you take her? No. No, I didn't take her, but I'm here to help find her. Nobody took Sue. She was just here last week. Are you up? I know you know where she is. You bring my Sue back, or I'll go where it goes. Sue comes here every week. There are no spies. Nobody took her. No! 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 You're lying! Okay. Everyone just calm down. Take a deep breath. It's okay. Hey! hey. Sit. All men should be brave, if you ask me. Brave, tall, and in uniform. Oh, that's my thing. <laughs> <laughs> Having high tea in London. London? How fancy. Did you see the queen? Well, I didn't think she was home, so I didn't <laughs> knock on the door. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on here? We were just having a little fun. Right, girls? Mm -hmm. Coloring books and puzzles. <laughs> what's next? Thank you. Where did you get this delicious tea? I called in a favor from my best friend. Oh. oh. And now I'm enjoying it with my best friend. Oh, Erica. Cheers. And our new best friend. Yes. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Well, girls. I think this is the finest tea party I've ever had. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> I'll be right back. Has anyone ever told you what beautiful hair you have? Thank you, Arvel. Doesn't she have beautiful hair? She does. And so do you. You think so? I do. Really? Yes. With one patron succumbing to multiple gunshot wounds late last night, Several others are still in critical who wish to attend. The police have confirmed that the shooter took his own life. Isn't it a shame, dear? At the house of the Lord of all places. Do you think it was the spies? 
I don't know, Helen. Such a lovely church. It is. Is it your church? No. Well, not anymore. It's my family's. Are they okay? Yeah. Well. How about that lunch? Would you like to give a prayer first? You start. loving arms around your people. Thank you for being with them. They need you. Amen. Amen. That woman is not my Sue. She took her. I know it. She's a spy. Wait. Hank was in the Navy, you know. He was? Oh, yes. He served on the USS Kansas, 1953. Sue dated a sailor. He stopped by a while ago, a strapping young man named Timothy. That wasn't Timothy. That was the mailman. He told you 10 times. Ladies, we had a lovely chat about Sue. I wish some of Sue's other friends would stop by. Oh, lovely. Does that look like Timothy? Helen, this is Tabitha, Sue's best friend. You, you know my Sue? Very well. What's her favorite color? Burnt orange. Because the leaves remind her of the times when you guys would roll in it in the fall when you visited your mom in New England. Sue loved those leaves. Mm -hmm. Did you tell you about the time we went apple picking? And it rained all day? And we hid under that apple tree for hours telling stories. Sue has the greatest stories. Do you remember any of them? A lot, actually. <laughs> well, you can stay right here. You can help me remember. I would love to help you remember all of Sue's stories. <laughs> Remember the story about bumblebees at the school at the summer? Mm -hmm. <laughs> she always knew how to be sneaky. <laughs> yes, she did. <laughs> oh, that's my Sue, one step ahead. <laughs> All right, two cups of peppermint tea for the chattiest girls in the joint. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Did Sue RSVP to Tomorrow's Social? Oh, we're hosting a kind of family gathering of sorts, and Sue ought to attend. I'll ask her again. Uh, maybe I can give her a call. Oh, that'll be wonderful, Tabitha. It'll be like two reunions. She'll never miss that. All right. I'll leave you ladies to it. Hey. Hey. What are you doing here? Oh, I was just chatting with the girls. You never told me how funny these two were. <laughs> He's been checked. He's not a spy. Thank you. I had to go over to the memorial built site, so 
I thought, why wouldn't I stop by? Oh, well, why don't you take your Landon on a tour? He's not mine. Okay. You see a flicker of the person you remember, and they see you. So it's okay to have a bad day. She's the hostess with the mostess. Oh, <laughs> to my best girls. And to my first six months on the job. Cheers. <laughs> Come on, Urba. Let's take things to the kitchen so we're not late for the chess tournament this afternoon. You know, Bert might upset George today. Not gonna happen. <laughs> 